members of this 10th assembly, distinguished colleagues, these leaders were personally written by the 27 members individually and sent to me in line with section 101 of the 1999 constitution as author. Distinguished colleagues, I will begin by reading the letter written by the right honorable barrister Dunle Mao, the deputy speaker of this house. It reads, the right honorable Martin Chika Mewili, DSSRS, Speaker, Rivers and Assembly, Moscow, Takot, Mr. Speaker, defection to the All Progressive Congress, APC. I write to bring to your attention my decision to leave the People's Democratic Party, PDP. This decision to leave the PDP is necessitated by the division in the People's Democratic Party of which I was elected to this house. In particular, the tussle around who the National Secretary of the PDP is has now sharply divided the party and made it unclear as to who is the National Secretary of the party, thereby making it difficult for me to chart an appropriate communication channel. There are currently different court processes as well as others making it impossible to identify who the authentic national secretary of the party is. Details of these orders of courts can be found in suit number FCT slash HC slash M slash 015 slash 23. Suit number FHC slash ABJ slash CS slash 1580 slash 2023 and suit number E slash 882 slash 2023. There's also a matter at the Federal High Court in Lagos in the same subject. The situation has made it imperative that I defect to the All Progressive Congress, APC. Therefore, I seek your indulgence in this regard as to do the needful and recognize me now as a member of the APC and do accept the assurance of my esteemed regards Sincerely, right on a Dumle Mao, DSSRS, Deputy Speaker, Member, Bukana, Constituency. Distinguished colleagues, this data is from the Deputy Speaker, as I said earlier, and uh, in line with section, in line with the Constitution, I have read the letter in the floor of this house. It is the duty of this house to, to find out whether the conditions upon which this defection is made is sufficient for him to actually defect from the People's Democratic Party to the APC. Distinguished colleagues, the section of the Constitution has made it clear the condition upon which a member can defect, which is a division in his political party where he was elected into the House of Assembly. And from the evidence that is before us, it is clear that there is division in the PDP. Because as it stands today, it is difficult for people to even know who the National Secretary of the Party is. And of course, the office of the Secretary, the National Secretary of the Party is key. It's by voter to be functioning of that party. There are now factions, some people are supporting the uh, Samuel Lion, while others are not. And this clear division has warranted the decision of right around the dilemma who the defect to the um, all progressive congress. On that note, distinguished colleagues, do we have any objection? Or do we have any reason? Do we think it is insufficient? Or the reasons he has uh, so preferred are insufficient for him to defect? Our members, is, I, I, I bring it open to the house. Do we have any objection to this? Okay, hold on. Yeah, yeah. Hey,